lot of rain to talk about, Lena, and you're already going to see it in the shot of downtown. Low clouds in the shot and even a few sprinkles. Radar is going to show you just that. Also, several advisories that we're dealing with right now as well. The brunt of the rain still sitting to our north over the Bay Area, over the Pacific Northwest as well. Rain turning to snow over the Sierra and we'll potentially see snow right here at home as well. You'll see a little piece of the system breaking off and that's exactly what we're seeing right here at home. Take a closer look at this and you're going to see rain approaching the coast, the basin already seeing a few drops here and there already looking at a winter weather advisory going into effect and several wind advisories for the Apple and Lucerne Valleys. Also for the Antelope Valley as well, expecting windy conditions and windier conditions as this cold front passes through by tomorrow afternoon. We're left with pretty windy conditions, but we're also looking at very wet conditions before that already looking at wet conditions out there. In fact, a few showers spanning from the San Fernando Valley all the way down to Long Beach, even toward Orange County towards Santa Ana. So again, this is the drill. A little bit of rain now, more rain tomorrow as we head into the next few days. Well, we're expecting showers on Thursday as we head into Friday. We're expecting heavier rain could see at least an inch or more in higher elevations. Also want to mention snow levels dropping to about 3500 feet on Wednesday night. We could see about maybe six to eight inches of snow in some spots and you'll see showers persisting through Saturday. The drier forecast as we head to Sunday and Monday, but we're going to recap all of this coming up in your five day forecast in just a little bit. Back to you. All right.